Good afternoon, and welcome back to www.shoeswapmarina.com. Although we're uh, in a very small patch of sunshine, it is shining here today. How nice is that? On the lot here, we have a 1996 Maxim 2300 SC with a Mercruiser 5.7 liter V8 carbureted 350 cubic inch motor with a Mercruiser Alpha 1 stern drive. Boat comes on a trailer and it's cleaned up pretty well in our service department. It has full camper canvas which you can see in other pictures and we're just gonna take a walk around the boat here. I think we've got about 160 hours on the boat and motor. And as you can see, we do have a few small blemish areas like these. But for the most part, the boat's in really good shape. And we'll just do a little walk around here. Now, if you've been following our website, you'll know that we do have a twin boat of this, which is a few years newer. It's actually sitting right beside it. And uh, I think that uh, there is a big difference in price between the two boats. There are many features that the more expensive boat has, as it is newer as well. Um, and I think that this one that we're looking at right now, for the money, is going to be very good value. Um, this boat's going to be listed at 14490 And that's a little cruise around the outside of it. And, uh, and we'll hop up inside and have a look there. Okay, now here we have the cockpit of the 96 Maxim, viewed from the swim grid. And as you can see, this seating layout gives you a lot of space. Uh, there is a pedestal mount for the table in the cockpit as well. Uh, there is a teak hatched ski locker in the center of the cockpit there. Under the carpet, of course. Nice little feature like this. Uh, the center cushion in the aft bench flips over. It's got a couple of cup holders recessed into it. Nice teak woodwork there. I mean, you don't see that stuff anymore. Nothing wrong with teak as far as wood goes. It will not rot. And as we step down, you really get a good sense of feeling of security in this boat. Uh, really high gunnels. Um, the cockpit area is really recessed low into the boat. As we look around here, you can see all the upholstery in this boat. It's in really good shape. Uh, it does have a CD stereo player, Clarion, or Sony, sorry, I believe. It is a Sony, yeah. And uh, I'll just pan over to the gauges and everything here. We've got a VHF radio mounted, flush mounted in there. Hour meter shows 161 hours. That's very low hours. A very nice, bright cuddy in this boat. Um... We're using all natural light as we always do here, and I mean you can just see that it's nice and bright and open in there. It feels like a boat a lot bigger than it is. This type of cruiser cuddy you typically don't have a cuddy that's that deep. You kind of have to crawl into the whole thing, and, and I just I just have to stoop. I don't have to crawl, so that's very nice. You will see other pictures on the website with it in the bed mode as opposed to dinette mode. Nice feature is this separate window from the companionway door. It's going to give you a little bit of extra ventilation um, and, and kind of gives you a lot of light in that room. Also gives easy access to the sink from the cockpit. Another handy feature. There's a little recessed place here to put a um, alcohol stove, which is a cool feature. And then you've actually got your own place to 
to put the porta potty. I've just got the uh, filler cushion stuffed in there for now. As you can see, the porta potty has its own privacy screen and everything. And once again, inside, all of the upholstery is. I mean, it's immaculate. I mean, the boat is very, very clean. And just back out of here. Swing around. As we can see, the snap out carpet is all in really good shape. Just below here, where you can see these lines, uh, that's where the swim uh, ski locker is, and that's got a nice teak lid to it, which adds a bit of, bit of class. And this lovely wide aft bench seat here, and then this center filler cushion can flip over to be a cushion, or it can be in this mode here to uh, house a couple of adult beverages. Very nice. And look at the day, it's even getting sunny out here now. I mean, you could be out there on a day like this, all by yourself. Not a care in the world. Flat calm. This is what the shoe swap's all about. I'm going to head out of the boat and give you my final thoughts. Okay, and so here we have the engine compartment of the 96 Maxim 2300. As you can see, it is a 5.7 liter V8. 350 cubic inch with fresh water cooling and the manifolds and block are all closed cooled which is a good system now as I said this boat has seen a bit of uh, saltwater use doesn't appear to be anything to be afraid of um, the mechanical inspection was good and so uh, I know the last few years it has been used up here on the Shushwap did sit for a couple of years and uh, it ran well for us on the lake test there you have it so there you have it it's a 1996 Maxim 2300 SC 5.7 liter Mercruiser closed cooled mechanically inspected detailed in overall very good shape and we're asking $14,490 Thanks again for coming by ShoeSwapMarina.com. Look at that, a patch of blue sky. Lovely day.